Hi, my name is Jonathan, and I would like to talk about what it means to be Jewish. Now, a couple summers ago, my brother David and I, we did an, a re, our research on our genealogy on Ancestry.com, because there were aspects of our genealogy that was a mystery to us, like um, what our great-grandparents looked like, and they're being a secret to who they were ethnically. And after doing our research on Ancestry.com, we had discovered that we were potentially half Jewish. Like, we, had, we knew that we were part Irish, like my last name is Irish, we were Irish, Polish, German, English, Ottawa, Indian, and Moroccan. But, but it turns out, I won't go into details, but we are in fact Polish and Irish and Ottawa, Indian. But not the German, not the English. Um, on both sides of my family, um, we are both Sephardic Jew and Ashkenazi Jew. And my parents deny it. Like, we show them the facts about our, our um, ancestry, and they refuse to believe it. And I, it was interesting to notice my own subconscious reaction to finding out that I'm half Jewish. Like, I had, I had expected, well, this mystery blood that's inside me. I thought we, my brother David and I thought maybe we were part black, um, or another tribe of Aboriginal American, or something. Like, I was expecting anything. But I would have been happy about it. But when I found out that we were half Jewish, I'll be honest, I was appalled um, to believe that. I, I was, because I'm a very progressive person, I was upset that that was my subconscious reaction to finding out um, I'm half Jewish. Like, my immediate reaction was, no, I cannot believe it. I am not half Jewish. Completely denial. Then, when I started to accept it, like, uh, my reaction was, well, how can I get the Jewish blood out of my system? That was not my conscious reaction. That was my, uh, subconscious reaction um, and I went through identity crisis of why that was my reaction um, why was I appalled at being Jewish like and then I discovered generally Gentiles non-Jews have within their subconscious a uh, anti-semitism that I did not realize and most Gentiles they do not know it but they are subconsciously um, anti-semitic for some reason. But anyway, so I started to accept the fact that um, I was half Jewish. And my brother, uh, like a few months ago, again, David and I did more research, and in fact, Ancestry.com is correct. We are half Jewish with Sephardic Jew, Sephardic Jews from Spain um, and from Palestine, and also Ashkenazi Jews from, uh, from Poland. Um, so, like, Starting to accept that fact. So, like, my next subconscious reaction um, to being Jewish is that suddenly I feel like an urgency to be successful in my life. Like, that was my next subconscious reaction, as, like, the expectancy, I have, like, high expectations for my own life. Um, I did not, that was not my conscious reaction. Like, the subconscious reaction within me was, now that I am apparently half Jewish, I felt this urgency to my life, um, sorry, to being successful, in, in what, being successful in life. Um, I don't know why that was my reaction. So, like, a lot of Jews are successful, but it's not a conspiracy. Um, so that's one thing I discovered. Like, I guess a lot of Jews feel that way. Like, your identity with being a Jew, you have a part of this identity of, um, because you're a Jew, a need, a deep urgency to be successful, um, to make a difference in the world, um, to change the world, and to make an identity for yourself. I don't know, that, that was my first, you know, my next reaction. I don't know why. So, like, I have that urgency 
my identity with being half Jewish, I have this urgency to be successful and just to grab the world by the throat and make a difference in the world. It was cool. And another, another thing that was really cool I discovered about being half Jewish is um, like having a deep connection with other Jews. Uh, a deep connection that I do not feel with like Irish people, other Irish people, um, other people who are ethnically Polish, and other people who are Aboriginal American. Like your identity with being Jewish, uh, like there's a deeper, I have a deeper connection with people who are Jewish. And so I still, if I'm honest, I'll be honest, I still haven't fully accepted that I am half Jewish. I have not yet visited a synagogue. Well, when I studied in the Middle East, I went to several synagogues. Um, well, I'm also an Eastern Orthodox Christian, and Eastern Orthodoxy is the branch of Christianity that's most Judaic. Um, the branch of Christianity that has the most um, influence of Judaism in it, so I do appreciate being Eastern Orthodox Christian. So, that's still part of my journey um, with knowing who I am as a Jew, half Jew. That's all I wanted to share. Thank you. I love you.